Everybody, this is our gospel with Summit Lending, and here's some mortgage uh, changes or updates uh, as of March 29, 2020. So we talked about rates, right, and why the Fed fund rate cut it to zero and why rates weren't coming down, and we talked about capacity, right? So um, all the lenders were at capacity, so they actually raised their rates pretty significantly for a while to get rid of the loans they had in their pipeline. So as of now, here's what's going on. It's more of a servicing problem. So the Fed, they don't want to cut rates too much because of early pay payoffs. So it's EPO. So when a servicer buys a loan from us or any lender or any bank, they pay 1%. Okay, so if it's $300,000 loan, they pay $3,000. Okay, and then they get paid like 30 basis points um, off what they make. So it usually takes a servicer to break even about three year mark maybe a little less but around the three year mark so they're not really making their money when they hold a loan for a long time that's when they start making their money it's more complicated than that but that's basically it so if rates really drop a lot then they're going to have a big turnover right so they're going to be losing money so when rates drop that quickly that's what's happening so on our rate sheets right now um, it's reflecting, I was always able to give, you know, I always give people two or three options. So uh, here's a free loan, here's one with just the closing cost or escrow cost, blah, 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 and it, you can buy it down. Now there's no free loans. They don't give us enough rebate to give free loans as of now, okay? So the only options I can give is where well, you just pay for your closing cost. Again, we roll that into your loan. And now it even makes sense to buy down the loan, maybe a point. Okay, so for example, I just quoted somebody on Friday, um, and I got them three and a quarter, uh, buying it down one one point. And again, we just add that to the loan amount, so it made more sense. I, again, I couldn't even give them a free loan because it didn't give me enough rebate to do that. So anyway, things are changing really quick, but still rates are good, especially on the buy down stuff. So uh, keep that in mind. But again, I'll keep you updated as we go. But this is Eric Oswald with Summit Lending. Have a great day.